United Nations, North Korea's deputy UN ambassador said Tuesday the country plans to launch many more satellites and accused the United States of trying to block its efforts to help peacefully develop outer space. Kim in Ryong told a UN General Assembly Committee meeting on international cooperation in the peaceful uses of outer space that the country's five year plan for 2016 to 2020 includes development of practical satellites that can contribute to the economic development and improvement of of the people's living. As a party to several space treaties, North Korea's space development activities are all ground on legal basis in all aspects, Kim said. But he said the United States is going frantic to illegalize our development of outer space, claiming the effort violates UN sanctions. The US is the country that launched the largest number of satellites, and yet it claims that our launch of satellites is a threat to international peace and security, Kim said. This is a preposterous allegation and extreme double standards. The United Nations, the US, and other countries view the North Space Launch Development Project as a cover for tests of missile technology, as ballistic missiles and rockets in satellite launches share similar bodies, engines, and other technology. North Korea is also openly working on developing nuclear armed missiles capable of striking the U.S. mainland. Kim said the Treaty on Outer Space states that it is a common asset of humankind and all countries can develop outer space without any discrimination. He said no article states that satellite launches threaten international peace and security, nor is there any article stipulating that one cannot use ballistic rocket technology in launching a satellite. He said the U.S. relies on illegal U.N. resolutions, referring to Security Council actions taken in response to North Korea's nuclear and ballistic missile programs.